Hey guys, this is DJ Lil Kevin. This is my first video on YouTube. Today is going to be a tutorial how to uh, get WinApp and how to get Shoutcast, how to get music for WinApp, and uh, how to DJ basically. Okay, guys. Yeah. So, first, let's start out with WinApp. Okay, guys. Yeah. So, first, you want to go to WinApp.com. Okay, guys. Yeah. WinApp. W I N A M P dot com. Okay, and go to free download. Okay, the page is gonna be like this. You go to free download and download it and install it, whatever. Okay, guys. And then after that, right, you're gonna have this little icon. So that means that you already have it on your computer. Okay, and then you're gonna go to Shoutcast. Okay, guys. And here, you're gonna go to right here, download BADJ right there. And uh, let's wait a bit. Oh my gosh. Sorry. Okay, guys. Then, then you're going to look at this broadcasting through a third party server stream hosting solution. Okay, guys. And uh, right here is going to say download the. On uh, number two, right? Is going to say download the Shoutcast Radio DSP plugin for WinApp. The DSP pl DSP plugin is uh, in is available here. Okay, so you click that, and then you basically download it from there. Okay, guys. See, that's how it is. And that's how it basically looks. Okay. Then after you install that, you guys are gonna open WinApp just by itself. Okay, guys. Don't think that there's like a shoutcast program. Okay, the shoutcast is in WinApp. Okay, guys. So even though you see like the installation thing, if you saved on your computer, just leave it like that. There's really no program. It's just like an add-on. Put it like that, okay? So then you're gonna go to uh, you're gonna go to options on the top. You're gonna go to preferences. You're gonna go wait. Hold on. Let's make it down. Okay. You're basically gonna start here, right? You're run no here pro probably. You're gonna go all the way down, right? You're gonna scroll down. And on on the top where it says plugins, go all the way down and go to DSP slash effect. And you're gonna see this, right? And it's gonna say null soft shock shoutcast source DSP V 1.9.0. You're gonna click that. Okay guys. And then you're gonna see this basically. Okay guys. And if you're in a DJ site already, you're gonna get all the radio info. Okay guys, so like where it says at, like it'll say the address on your radio info or something you'll put the address here you'll put the port here you'll put the password here okay guys and for your dj name you put it there dj little kevin see right there that's my dj name and then our url you have to put this your uh dj site okay guys and it has to be with the http whatever all that stuff uh see like that howpfm.com okay guys and then uh and then to connect you basically click connect okay guys and to talk oh and wait my bad and also on encoders encoders basically means how good the quality is for your music okay guys so uh you're gonna basically start off on 24 is, is basically gonna be like that 24 you're gonna go to 64 k b p s okay guys 64 Okay, and when you want to talk on the mic, you have to click sound card input. Okay, guys, you'll know that you're talking when uh, this little green bar goes and this thing on the bottom shows up. Okay, guys, and to only play the music is WinApp recommended. Okay, guys, see WinApp recommended that when you know you're when you know that you're playing uh, the music, you're not going to see nothing down here. Okay, guys. Okay, guys, so now that's how you do all the stuff. Okay, now. We're gonna go to the music, okay guys. You guys probably have LimeWire or something, or Frostwire, have MP3 Rocket. Uh, if you want to download this, go to mp3rocket.com or mp3rocketpro.com, okay guys. And like, you know how you search up your songs and everything. I got, I do not have to teach you that on your library, right? Like for some people, like LimeWire, you already have this. So why isn't this thing clicking? Oh my gosh. Why this freeze? Hold on, let me pause the video really fast. Sorry guys, let me pause it. Okay guys, we are back. <laughs> I'm sorry for that. Okay, you're gonna go to the library, right? And like, you're gonna see your library, all your songs here. Basically, this is for LimeWire and FrostWire. Okay, yeah, so you guys already know how to do this. 
you're gonna click explore on the bottom okay and these are all your songs here all your songs that you have on your library basically if you didn't know that then okay guys and if you want to transfer your music from uh, from uh, LimeWire FrostWire to Winamp so you can play it look uh, see this is shorty like my Bow Wow you just click it click it once okay you guys drag it over here it doesn't really matter just these two boxes right here I'll do it see you saw that little thing right there really fast that means that you did it okay guys and if it doesn't show up just make sure sure you like mine right there see straight like mine okay guys that's how you stretch up your thing oh and also guys if this is if this just pops up to you like that right here I know this happens to a lot of people that's why they get confused sometimes it just pops up regularly right to go to the to go like to the library where I was and stuff, that's your main section where you're gonna DJ. Go to audio on the left, audio, okay guys, and that's gonna take you like where I was. So basically, you wanna stay on this page when you DJ mainly, okay? And this is basically what WinApp is for right here. Okay guys, I'll show you an example right now, okay guys? I'll show you an example. Okay, I'm gonna make pretend to talk on the mic. Hello, this DJ, look, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna play, uh, I put it on for my city, okay? Now watch. You're gonna click on it double two times, and on the left top corner, you're gonna see it playing right there. See? And and you're gonna click Win App Recommended, like really fast. I didn't do it really fast. Let's do it one more time, guys, okay? Let me do it one more time. Make pretend we're talking, whatever, okay? Yo, this is DJ Lil Kevin, stay tuned, guys, whatever. Okay, you click on Win App Recommended, and then you click on the song. And there, that's it. That's all you gotta do. We gotta be connected to the server again, once again. So, see, and you're, I'm 100. You're like 100 sure that you're playing the song for the radio, okay, guys? Basically, yes, guys. Okay. What else? What else? If you have any problems, uh, send me a comment or a message on YouTube, okay, guys? And uh, for all the Hobo users out there, add me the Beast 100. And uh, once again, guys, uh, what else should I teach you guys? Also, if you want a list of uh, of like uh, torrent downloads like like this right here, I'll say them right now: Frostwire, LimeWire, MP3, Rocket Pro, Ayers, Galaxy. That's basically it. Oh, and also, uh, Donkey, something like that. I forgot. So, yeah, guys. This is basically how to use WinApp and DJ on it. Okay, guys. Uh, so, yeah, guys. I hope this tutorial helped you out to DJ. Okay, guys. For all the people who have problems with WinApp. And, oh, yeah. Once again, my bad, guys. Uh, like, you know when you have, like, this right here, right? Let's say you're playing a song, right? Like, you're gonna click right here. Right? And you're done, right? Let's just say you're done. Right here, you're gonna see it on the bottom behind the Winamp screen. This happens to almost everyone. This happened to me too. You're always gonna forget. You're gonna be like, "What the heck? Why is it? Why is it? Why didn't the? Why isn't the page showing up or something?" Just click on the bottom. See, right down the bottom, you see like a little section of it. And like, if you open Winamp and you don't see nothing at all, let's just say it's like, like, like that maybe. All right? This is what you gotta do. Uh, you go right here. See this on the bottom right it says it's like a little arrow going up you click on that you click on this you drag it down so like there's a point where you can see it you put that thing down again and that's it and then when you want to connect you talk whatever so yeah guys that happens to everyone okay guys so if that happens to you don't worry okay guys so this is basically my tutorial and uh have a great day guys and uh have fun djing homies